U.S. advisor explains how Prince Harry can save America reputation as audiences turn on Duke. A former special advisor on UK-US relations gave Prince Harry some advice on how he can improve his reputation in America as he states a portion of the country are beginning to turn on the royal. Former U.S. Anglo-American advisor and senior fellow of the Bow Group think tank Lee Cohen told Express.co.uk that he has noticed a large part of the American audience begin to turn on Prince Harry due to his recent comments and actions. While Mr. Cohen admits not everyone in the U.S. has been put off the royal, he states the Duke of Sussex has a lot to learn from the Queen whose popularity ranks higher than most U.S. presidents. Mr. Cohen then told Express.co.uk what he thinks Prince Harry could do to improve his reputation and recalled his personal political and royal experiences to aid the Duke. Mr. Cohen was asked what advice he would give to Prince Harry and Meghan following several U.S. political commentators attacking them for the political comments. During his sit-down with the Armchair Expert podcast, Prince Harry said the First Amendment was bonkers. The royal also attacked his father Prince Charles and the way he raised him, saying he passed his trauma on to his children. Mr. Cohen told Express.co.uk, I would say to improve their popularity among right-thinking Americans and most Brits that Harry certainly should avoid the controversial topics and political topics. If he were still in Britain and were still a working royal or an active royal, he would be required to avoid those topics here. Those safeguards have fallen away and HES at his own discretion, addressing topics some that alienate a good deal of the population. The other advice that I would give to Harry is stop absolutely stop criticizing your family. A family that is very respected, certainly your own country, and has great popularity. The Queen polls in the United States, interestingly enough, higher than most of the U.S. presidents. According to a YouGov poll, the Queen is the most popular royal in the U.K. and came third in the most admired women in the world. Former President Barack Obama was the only U.S. president to rank higher than the Queen in popularity. Mr. Cohen continued, and he could take a lesson from that because the reason she probably does pull that high is because she doesn't insert herself into controversial or political arguments or issues that could cause alienation among half of the population or part of the population. The Queen has historically adopted a never complain, never explain policy where she positions the royal family outside the sphere of opinion so it can put duty foremost. Mr. Cohen also told Express.co.uk that he believes the removal of Harry and Meghan's titles will do little to change their popularity and pull in the US. He explains much of the usefulness of the titles have already been squeezed out and that they are beginning to transcend them by turning into a brand themselves. The Anglo-American expert added many Americans are unaware of royal protocols and the small details of them so are less phased when Harry or Meghan do not follow them.
In April, a YouGov poll found Harry and Meghan were the only royals not to enjoy a rise in positive opinion with even Prince Andrew seeing a small rise. They remain the third and second least favorable royals with Prince Andrew taking the top spot.